Today is the 21st of July, 2024. It's a Sunday. I'm in my birthplace of Dundas Town, where I've lived for 62 years. And the last couple of months, for the first time, I was afraid for my life. There was only one time during Hurricane Doreen that I was afraid when I saw the water coming up five, six feet in the house. I said that was the end game. That was the only time I was afraid. This was from 2019. But from 2019 to 2024, July, I was afraid for my life and I'm still afraid for my life because I believe that the police from the Marshaba district wants to assassinate me. They don't want to kill me. I'm too important to just kill. They just want to silence me. And I was astonished to see the power of the video. You know that you're saying something when you have important clientele that you never discussed your video with is asking what happened to you. And I was in awe, I said to my guests, y'all watch my videos? And they would reply, every video that you sent out, we can't wait to see the next one because it's give detail, information. You're the only person in the whole of Abaco that give us detail, videograph on what's going on in Abaco. I say, wow. But the police, we have all sort of stuff going on in Abaco, but they are not at all interested in murder. Murder is the end game. We have four to five to six murders. Five minutes from the police station, nobody has been arrested. Bakai has been arrested, sent to Fox Hill, rearrested, held for days because of a phone and my constitutional right to use a phone, to have the freedom of speech, the freedom of movement, the freedom of association. The very fabric of our constitution is being um, abused by the Marshal of Police under the leadership of Will Hart. So much that I pocket up to go to Nassau in the House Assembly to speak to the Prime Minister, to speak to um, Bean Monroe, to let him know that um, Will Hart is a bad example of policing. Over decades I've been telling them before the Tribune came out that the most, the number one most corrupt industry, government agency in the country is the police station. This is the police force. I've been saying that for decades, that they are capable of bribery, thief, and murder. So I am indeed afraid for my life because all Will Hart has to do is order it. And them little dumb conks under him, they quickly execute me. So I'm begging, I'm asking the Minister of National Security, the Commissioner of Police, um, Ms. Knowles in charge of Grand Bahama, to quickly remove Bill Hart off the face of Abaco so Kai Mills can sleep easily because my life feels threatened. As an elected man, my, le my life feels threatened by the presence of the chief of police that you all promoted without solving one murder. I have been locked away because of my constitutional right to shoot a video. Kai cares and I hope 
that the people responsible for Haban Bilhad and Abaco quickly remove him so Kai could easily move about Abaco as my constitutional rights give me the right to do such. Kai cares. Late evening in Abaco, hoping that the authorities finally remove Will Hard out of Abaco. <laughs>